Hey guys, it is Duke, and welcome back to another episode of Tech It Classic. How are you guys doing today? I hope you're doing fantastic. I know I am, and I'm glad to be back. So, in the last episode, we had a present and a goodbye. So, yeah, aptly titled, you know, I think it very, very appropriate. Uh, we lost meme 6, meme 7, depending on what you want to call him. Um, he goes by both. <laughs> Uh, I guess that's what happened when you get locked out of your one account because you forget the password. Uh, but anyways, yeah, he gave us a little bit of a present before he departed from the series. Uh, and now we're back on our own. Back to pre-episode 4, if you guys don't recall. Uh, we started this series alone. And we met him along the way. He decided to come on down and join us. We had a lot of fun with it. Um, but he... No longer is interested in making videos on this series. I explained that all uh, last episode. But now, yeah, back by ourselves. And uh, if you're wondering what we're doing down in the big nuke hole, it is a tremendous spot for finding resources. I do have to say, <laughs> I've just been digging a little bit uh, because all of that stuff is just is there. I haven't found any diamonds yet, but I know they're around somewhere. And uh, I gotta say, hmm, nukes do good. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but anyways, guys, I'm glad to be back, and I hope you guys are as well. So, uh, yeah, got a lot of feedback. Got a lot of feedback. There's a creeper in there. We're just gonna skedaddle. Don't want to deal with that. We need to figure out a way to get back to our Shrek home, which is our current home. It's doing fine. I'm fine with it. We, uh, we're gonna have to move out here soon. We may move out in today's episode, uh, because we need to get ourselves a proper setup, uh, very, very, very soon. So, oh, God! We made it. Okay. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of remnants of stuff, guys. As you know, obviously, the new coal. It's big. And, uh, there's a little bit of memes base left intact. Uh, a little bit of mine, you can see on the mini-maps, coming up. Didn't really clear out a whole lot. Uh, but anyways, I got a lot of feedback in last episode. I got to thank you guys so very much for that. Because you guys were very, very supportive with everything. And you gave me some ideas. I got to say thanks. Uh, really, really glad that you guys are happy the series is back. Okay, buddy. Okay, buddy. You're going to die. This isn't This isn't 1.9 PvP. I, I can destroy you pretty quickly. Uh... But yeah, thank you guys for those ideas. And we have three that I'd like to hit on. And oh yeah, they were good. So number one, number one, we heard a lot, make a factory and produce a certain type of thing. I feel like that's, that's Tech It as a whole. If you're not making a factory, you're not really playing Tech It. And uh, we will definitely be doing that very soon. What we're going to be producing... I don't know yet. We'll figure it out. Uh, <laughs> looking forward to figuring it out. Uh, but I know we will. No worries about that. We're, uh, we'll get there. Oh, I cannot click and drag. I forgot about that. Uh, yeah, so that, that's uh, it's pretty darn fantastic. You know, you guys came up with a good idea there. <laughs> Obviously. Uh, I, actually, I mean, I am being uh, completely honest with you. I'm not trying to be sarcastic. If, 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 if I'm coming out a little bit sarcastic when I say... Uh, I'm not just no I am I do mean it thank you guys really from the bottom of my heart I appreciate it uh, so I'm gonna take that idea we're definitely doing that I mean come on how could we not but we are also going to be trying to incorporate that with another one of the ideas I was given and that was to build in the sky like mr. creeper right here is doing for whatever reason he's on that pole I don't know. I don't know what he's doing up there. He might see me. He does see me. Will he jump? No, he knows that'll hurt. He knows. He's a smart creeper. Um, can I get myself a way down? I can't. Perfect. That might cause a little bit of lag, but oh well. Uh, so build up in the sky. Tremendous. You know, floating islands. That's, that's really, really cool. I do like that. So thank you for... I'm pretty sure only one person said something like that. Uh... So, we will take the idea of a factory, and we will take the idea of building in a sky, and we will build a factory in the sky. Absolutely 
really cool. I mean, that, that just sounds awesome. Uh, so I'm really excited to get working on that. And then, the most unique idea, and I only heard this once, uh, was we have a volcano around, okay? Uh, and we have sort of ruins. So why not turn this area into a little bit of a Pompeii sort deal? So if you guys do not know, maybe... Some of you are not a fan of history in any way, or or maybe you just really don't know. Uh, but Pompeii was an old city in Italy, pretty ancient. Uh, it's, it's been gone for quite some time. But it used to be a very thriving city, and a long time ago, a volcano, the, the, the big volcano next to it. I'm pretty sure this Mount Vesuvius could be wrong with that. I'm pretty sure that's the name. If it's... Ah! Whoo! Oh, God. We we experienced almost death right there. But I'm pretty sure it's Mount Vesuvius. 90% sure. But there's 10%. I could be wrong. <laughs> uh, yeah, anyways. It erupted. And there were two cities actually next to it. I do not recall the name of the one city. But Pompeii. It's the main city. It's the one that people think about being destroyed by a volcano. And it was destroyed by a volcano, completely covered in ash, uh, you know, fiery balls from the depths of the world came firing on over into the city and burnt it to the ground, destroyed it, covered it in a layer of ash, and why, I mean, that's, it's obviously, very, very crazy historical moment, uh, but why not take that idea and sort of Turn it into a little bit of something here in our world. So maybe, you know, we have these ruins. We could build up, make a couple houses or so. Nothing too crazy, but, uh, you know, some ruins. Maybe not full houses that people would currently live in. Uh, but buildings, rather, that sort of make sense for ruins, you know. We build ruins, and then we cover them in ash, just ever so slightly. I'm thinking, actually, gravel is perfect for it. I mean, look at this texture. That's the closest we're going to get to ash in this mod pack. I, I looked up ash. I looked up silt. I looked up dust uh, in the too many items here and did not find any of those. So sort of out of luck there. But I do know that we can use the gravel. That was a squid. Close call. I was worried because it didn't make any noise. It just sort of died. So that could have been a creeper. Uh, here's one over there, uh, but yeah, so what I'm thinking, all right, we have three tremendous ideas, and I love each and every one of them a lot, so thank you to those people who commented, supported me on last episode, uh, as always, you guys are just great fan base, and I am so very happy that you guys love what I'm doing, so I'm thinking, we take Pompeii, okay, and we have it. Right outside, right outside uh, by the volcano. Oh, that's wrong. I meant to click period. Period. Can we just look at the map? I don't know if we have an opportunity to look at the map uh, like we do in Joycraft. Because you guys don't recall, we can just bring up a full map. I don't think we can do that in this, sadly. Uh, which would be very, very cool if we could. But I don't think, I don't think we're in luck there. Um... But anyways, it, you guys know where the volcano is. It's just, just right over there. And this is crazy looking because we are in the void fog and stuff. But we can still somewhat see out. Uh, uranium, I don't know if we'll technically need that right off the bat. But we'll grab it anyways. Uh, so we have the volcano. We have our own little Mount Vesuvius that can erupt and destroy those ruins. And turn them into ruins and cover them in dust, silt ash whatever we want to consider it uh, and even though it's all totally role play and non-existent it would be really cool to have our new industrial factory floating in islands above it and you can look down you can see the ruins see what we did in the past see all the stuff we did with meme and and just and just completely live a different life so it could be really cool We'd have all of our stuff elevated. We could be living off, uh, you know, nuclear power and solar power because we'll be up there. No reason to burn coal. Uh, 
uh, you know, be floating in the islands. It would be absolutely tremendous. And how did that happen? Um, but yeah, really, really excited, guys. Uh, I'm sorry if this intro clip is long. I actually did that with my mini biomes episode you're going to see tomorrow, which, by the way, if you guys do not watch mini biomes, which I understand some of you are just here for Tech It, I do strongly rep recommend that series. I'm having a lot of fun with it, and I know the viewers are as well. So go check that out if you haven't already. Um, but like I said, sorry for the lengthy intro clip. It's it's the same in both today's episode and tomorrow's in the mini biomes. Uh, but we you want to see something? We didn't do a whole lot in the past couple episodes. You know, there were mainly role play and and sort of talking about the series and stuff as a whole. So let me go ahead. And get on out of here, <laughs> gather up some stuff, and let's start getting to work on getting back in the flow of things. Alright guys, so we are on up here now, and I don't like the wind sounds. It's going to be kind of annoying. I don't know how to solve that. I don't know what we can do to get rid of the wind sounds. Uh, so if you guys do know, please, please help me out. Uh, in the comments below, that would be absolutely fantastic if someone could help me out there, teach me, teach me the ways of turning off sounds. Because, man, if I have to listen to wind blowing the entire time, every episode from here on out, no one's gonna watch these videos anymore. I'm gonna hate producing them, and that would be a lose lose. So yeah, we need to figure that out. I mean, we're even hearing wind sounds. At this level, which it, it just can't happen. So, we're going to need to solve that. But, my next project, guys, is, as you know, we have that up there. I went all the way up to block 128. I feel like that makes sense, considering sea level is 64. So, you know, 64 above sea level makes a lot of sense. We're all the way up there. Uh, and our next thing is we're going to come along and we're going to tear down all these trees because... What's left, uh, they still exist. So we're going to have to climb up, get rid of those blocks. It's going to kind of suck. Uh, luckily, there's not too many floating stairs <laughs> for whatever reason. And then, this might take a while, we're going to take all of the dirt, all the grass, and we're just straight up going to clear it out from probably there on around here or on the Shrek all the way over to the water and then on over to the pit and on over to wherever the biome changes I'm pretty sure there's a river over here somewhere so this is gonna take a while guys I don't know if we'll get it done in today's episode but you know we're starting a huge project here with the whole Pompeii thing so we're going to need the ability to be able to make this look good so clearing out all this is going to have to happen and yeah we'll, we'll clear out a decent area you know uh, uh, enough that pretty much this entire biome has changed <laughs> oh boy that's gonna be a lot we've been doing that in our let's build in the creative let's build if you guys are familiar with that series uh, the concrete world world <laughs> just completely changing biome block by block and while that is good, while that is good, uh, you know, it's just, ugh. Now we got to do that here. Oh, we don't even have creative. So luckily we're not placing anything. But think about it, guys. We're going to have to come on in here and just completely just tear all this out. No way we're going to be able to get that done in today's episode. It's going to be a start of a project. But I'm actually really looking forward to it, because what we're going to do, uh, you know, once we've cleared out enough to the stone level, we'll come in with some gravel, cover that all up after we've made the ruins, um, which is going to be really, really good, because once we have the ruins built uh, on the, the stone level and gravel covering it up, it's going to have an entirely different look. I mean, this, this area, guys, is going to be probably completely unrecognizable. We may get to the point where it's like, wow, is this even the same world? So I'm really looking forward to getting to that point. Really think it's going to be something fun to do. Uh, 
<laughs> so this is going to be awesome. Uh, I'm really looking forward to this, guys. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, um, but I'm so glad to have inspiration for the series again. Uh, you know, it was it was really rough when we were getting to the point where Equivalent Exchange had taken control of everything and there was no real reason to continue. Uh, and we may not get into, you know, we may not get deep into a mod pack, or a mod, per se, in this episode or the next. We're probably going to be using micro blocks, so we will technically be using mods. Plus, we're going to be using, you know, modded tools like the emerald pickaxe and stuff. Uh, stuff like that, you know, there's going to be modded stuff, obviously, that will be apparent uh, for us. But... It's not like there's going to be machines and stuff, so, uh, you know, <laughs> just bear with me, guys, because this is going to be awesome. It's going to be a really cool, a really cool build. We need all this dirt for our islands up there, um, and once we have jetpacks, we can fly to the islands. It's, gonna, it's, gonna, it's just going to be so cool, so, so very, very cool. Uh, I don't know if I can, yeah, that's not going to work. I don't know how we're going to get rid of that, to be honest with you. Uh <laughs> Whew, we may just leave it and cover it up because these are a pain in the butt. Uh, but just gonna keep clearing stuff out. Gonna cleep, keep, cleep, cleep, cleep is not a word. I don't know if that's a word in any language. It's just, it's just, it should not have happened. It should not have been spoken. Uh, I think I should actually sleep the night away. Sleep. Oh man, we're just including L's wherever we feel L's are needed, and they never are. So. Genius. Let me keep clearing this stuff out, guys. And I will be back with you after the zombie attacks me. Got him. Alright, guys. So we are back, and I am climbing up the ladder because it's nighttime, and I'm not going to be doing any digging at night because, well, even though it doesn't really matter if there's mobs because I can fight the ones off that I don't want to deal with, and creepers actually speed up the process of digging every out I'm, I'm just gonna sleep because it's, it's so much nicer also I gotta say guys the wind it's it's obnoxious need to get rid of that soon as possible uh, but let's throw everything in the chest that we can for now we're getting ourselves quite a bit of dirt as you guys can see you know we didn't have really any dirt um, here let's okay so we got that much plus that plus a stack okay so yeah, that's actually a decent bit of dirt, honestly, for the fact that we've dug, I think, just that. A little bit extra. I, I know we have also a creeper explosion there, and we're going to get another one here in a second. Um, but I wanted to bring you guys back because I want to start doing a little bit uh, of building, finally. Beautiful, right? I'm, I'm excited for this. Uh, I just want to get some... Some ideas of ruins. So let's grab our handsaw and let's get ourselves some slabs. Can we not? <gasps> no! Marble. Oh, what? What can this, the iron one, actually be used for? Wool? Wool. Wool. Just wool. Goodbye, Iron Handsaw. You have failed me. Um, <laughs> ah, shoot. I don't have enough. I guess I could use diamonds. Eh, might as well. We have 32 of them. I don't, I don't really care. Plus, that means we'll get ourselves a handy-dandy good one that'll last a while, too. So that's good. All right. So there... We need iron, don't we? Yeah, I think, I think it's iron. Need a little bit of iron. There we go. When we're only using two, actually, that's, that's really good on the diamond front. I like that. That is fine. Fine with me. We're getting a good little bit of stuff. So let's turn those into slabs. We'll turn half of those into slabs. Let's hop down here. And let's get ourselves to work. Because it is finally time to start an idea. Also, gravel cannot be chiseled up. Dang it, I keep calling it a chisel. Uh, and I think this is because my mind, when I'm thinking about mods, is going, you know, new day, in with chiseling bits, you know, n the new age mods, the, the, everything that Minecraft has now on the mod front. 
but this is tacky, guys. This is this is some retro <laughs> Minecraft mods, uh, as retro as Minecraft mods go. So, outside of Better Than Wolves, which honestly really cool mod when you think about. It. So, clear out this little area here, and I'm really just gonna go on ahead. And we're not trying to build anything too fancy. Let's just let's just get ourselves what would have been a structure. So as you can see, uh, maybe we'd be going up there. We'd be having a little bit of something right there. Maybe I don't know. We'd bring that one up. I don't know. Maybe this side's broken down, which is fine. It's, it's sort of sort of broken down a little bit. This piece fell down here. Okay, uh, we have a little bit right there, maybe something like that right there as well. Let's bump out that one. Let's take out that and that actually. Okay, and then we'll say there should be marble there, there should be marble there. There'd be marble in those places there, that place as well. Down here it fits. Uh, and maybe there was some like that. We can just say maybe the slabs are like where pieces sort of fell off you know it, it's sort of like this used to be a full block but the the ash the burning fire of lava just destroyed it all sort of deal I feel like that would be kind of cool uh, I don't know I think this concept the idea makes a lot of sense maybe there's a little bit hanging somehow it it, it hung on I don't know Maybe that's supported because it's connected or something like that. That could be something. We have it sort of pushed out to the side there. It fell, you know, but it didn't crumble all the way down. It hugged the wall as it came down. That could be kind of cool. Okay, so we have a little bit of that. And then we would take the gravel and just start covering everything up. Uh, all of the stone. And the gravel, the gravel's not super cheap. Oh, geez. Plus, we lose some every once in a while. It's not super cheap, but it's not too expensive either. So, I don't I don't really care um, if we use a lot of it. And it takes us a while to get a lot of it. Because, you know, nothing can be perfect. And, obviously, we're sort of out of luck when it comes to other types of blocks here. Um, that still look the style we want. Because, obviously, gravel in this mod pack matches what we want most of all you know more than anything else that is what we want so how does that look it's not bad I actually kinda like it it does okay okay so here's what I'm thinking if we sit here and look at it it looks kind of out of place it looks a little a little little a lot a little 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 lot okay uh, just a bit but I think I think guys if we were to replicate that over and over and over again in little places, oh, that would look awesome. It would look so cool. I'm going to take a screenshot of that, actually. You know, why not make it the screenshot? It's so simple, okay? This is such a little bit. And we're only going to be using marble and gravel, but that means we have to go get all that. Oh, there's gravel right there. Perfect. Uh, more right there. Oh, wow. It wants me to turn this all into it. But... We're going to have to come through in every place we see grass. We're just going to have to come on in and tear it out. We're going to have to cut all these trees down. Not a huge deal because, think about it, we're going to be getting a lot of wood. A uh, good bit of saplings so we can replant when need be. We're going to be using, we're going to be getting a ton of dirt, which is great for our islands up there, uh, which will be coming around soon. You know, this is all going to be working together as one. So, I would like to thank you guys so very much for the ideas because... I'm sure nobody really realized it because they didn't know that I would be combining all the ideas rather than just using them all at once or rather than all at once just separately. I don't know. Having a little bit of trouble talking right now. I don't know. It's late. I've been playing some PUBG with the with the boys. Um, having a lot of fun there. And my voice is a little tired. So I think I'm going to wrap up the episode uh, right here, guys. But I thank you guys for watching and, uh, you know, getting back in the swing of things. This was our first episode where we've actually done something considering the fact the last episodes have been kind of role play and sort of oh you tell me what to do sort of deal now we have a plan we have a project three ideas rolled into one 
and a lot of digging to do. So anyway, guys, hope you guys have enjoyed. This has been Duke. If you liked today's video, please be sure to leave a like, comment down below. The link is next. And if you're new to the channel or the series, be sure to subscribe. This has been Duke. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.